are opening at a music festival, and she put together all these originals, and she killed it. And tonight, she has put together a band for us, and I'm sorry I can't honor the bandmates. I know you're both very established and important. We've, we've got Evan and Django. I don't know their biographies, but you're in for such a treat tonight. And when you fall in love with Brooke, don't forget that her cards over here have a QR code, so you can find her online at Brooke Delgado Sings. They're going to fall in love with her. She's pursuing music school. I'm just going to stop talking and let you experience the magic. Please give a warm welcome to Brooke. Thank you for that intro, Darcy. Darcy put this whole show together. Woo! Everybody doing? Good, good. Uh, we're gonna groove tonight, so you might find yourself moving your hips a little bit. That's all right. Snapping your fingers, you can clap if you want to. Um, everybody sitting down, but if you want to stand up, and just kind of like I'll be on stage doing this. You can do this too. All right. So this first song I wrote as say, you can get back on your feet again if you fall down. That's kind of what this song's about. It's got a little groove. It's got this groove. It's called I Won't Let Me Down.
This is a kazoo, and everyone in this room can play this kazoo. It's just, it, it, you just blow, which is what they told me about the harmonic. It's your Carolina Hart. They're singer songwriters here, right? Yeah. Yes. Somebody got K-Pop from there? one or two mildly sad songs tonight, so you guys are for a treat. Uh, this, this next song, we're just going to kind of jam it out, and I wrote these lyrics um, because you ever, like, you grow up, everybody grows up, right? We, we're not the same people we were many, many years ago. This guy up front says he hasn't grown up yet. Yeah. <laughs> So I wrote this song because um, I left my hometown 20 years ago, and I always get scared going back to my hometown because people remember me from 20 years ago, and I'm really not that person anymore, but I'll run into people, and they're like, oh, I remember when you did all this stuff, and I'm like, yeah, I don't do that anymore. So uh, that's what this song's about. This song's like, I'm not, the same, I'm not that same person anymore. Um, and I don't really have a title, just a jam song. <laughs>
I need a chorus. I got a song's not done, I need a chorus. And I was at a song night retreat with these guys actually, and we jammed out it. And we're like, you don't need a chorus. It's just, the song can just be that. And so that, that's how that came about. Uh, this next song has a story. So story time. Even if, if you've seen me perform before, um, I usually talk a lot more than what I've been talking. So here's. Here, here's some talking, I guess. Uh, so this next song I wrote, um, I wrote it for my mom. And what you need to know about my mom is that she passed away in 2013. But it's okay because I smile when I think about my mom. Um, I remember when she passed, I was at her house and I was outside of her garden. And I see this yellow butterfly flying by and it was so vivid. It was just bright, bright yellow butterfly. And so I told my sister about it because it just stood out to me. And my sister says, I saw that same butterfly. So we were, we were like freaking out because we both saw this yellow butterfly. Later that same day, we're around the kitchen table with a lot of my family, my dad, my aunts, and we're telling them about this yellow butterfly. My dad looks up out the window. He says, you mean that butterfly? And that yellow butterfly is fluttering outside the window. And we're just all staring at this yellow butterfly. So now when I see yellow, yellow butterfly, I think of my mom. And um, I wrote this song in a weekend, and I, I was just kind of missing her. And I was like, I want to write a song about my mom. I want to write a song that makes me smile and reminds me about all the good things about my mom. So this song is appropriately called Yellow Butterflies. Smell the grass on a summer afternoon See the fireflies under a new moon The wind is blowing a melody through the wind chimes I bet that song's for you La di da da, la di da di la di da. Reminds me of the yellow butterfly. Oh, how quickly the days go by. Wish I had a little more time with my sweet yellow butterfly. Your heart. Thank you. 
all the music compositions that's, that you guys have heard tonight. And on bass, we have Stingo Rose. Thank you, Thank you, Evan, for being on stage with me tonight. This next song, um, I accidentally wrote on the guitar. I do not play guitar. I actually play piano. I'm not playing a piano tonight. So I picked up the guitar. I had no idea what I was playing. And I I was playing the first two chords. And then I just started singing uh, just random words, which are the words you're going to hear tonight. And they're like, oh, that sounds good. What song is that? And I was like, I don't know. I'm just making it up. And so. Um, Evan took that song and created the rest of the chords, so um, I am claiming the first two chords of this song, so I wrote it on, key, on, a, on guitar. It's called Leave Me Down. Thank you. 
great night, guys. Yeah. Yeah.